So we're going to load the thread into the thread stand, bring it up through the upper eyelet. Now we're going to go to the tension assembly, go under the first part of the tension assembly eyelet, go around it, and through the top of the second eyelet. Bring it in between the tension discs. Make sure it's nice and secure inside the tension discs. Now I'm going to bring my thread through one of the holes of the bobbin, push the bobbin onto the spindle, pull the spindle forward to activate the bobbin winder. Note, you do not have to release the clutch on this to wind the bobbin. You can wind the bobbin as you're sewing. When you have enough thread on the bobbin to secure the bobbin thread, snip it on the top so there's no thread hanging over. Continue to sew and your bobbin will wind. When the bobbin is full, it will stop spinning.